Not even the pandemic can stop the completion of the Australia Pantaleon Bridge, expected to be finished by April. The structure will connect the cities of Makati and Mandaluyong. But unlike traditional bridges, this one does not need pillars for support. How is that possible? This is through a method called balanced cantilever method with traveling forms. So how does it work? Cement is poured from both sides of the bridge, covering 5 meters at a time. After a few days of drying, the process is repeated until both ends meet in the middle. The blue form travelers are used to support the construction from above the bridge. Authorities say this will help speed up the bridge's completion. So yung work na sa bridgeway lang at hindi kailangan harangin yung ilog ng uh, dati kasi kailangan mag kailangan mo maglagay muna ng barge pero ngayon dahil sa traveling forms yung trabaho nasa taas. This is only the third bridge in the country that used this construction method and more in the short bridge projects in the pipeline are expected to use this very method. This technology has been uh, used in our other project in Claridel Bypass, in uh, BGC, at uh, ito ay uh, marami pang proyekto na gagawin dito. In terms of uh, yung strength, uh, parehas lang, but in terms of the time, mas mabilis. The Public Works Department expects the China-funded bridge to ease traffic along EDSA. This, uh, this was given as a grant from China at a cost of about, uh, estimated cost of about 1.4 billion pesos. 1.4 Yes. Pero at no cost to government. Uh, we're expecting uh, tens of thousands of cars a day on that daan dito. Hindi na kailangang duman pa sa Guadalupe. Teresa Armatam, We Are One News.